Surely, you love your cat. But are you always behaving in a way that leaves no doubt in their mind? Many cat owners unintentionally make mistakes that can break their furry friend's heart or even put their health at risk. Let's reveal what those things are right now. Number 1. Scolding Unfortunately, scolding their feline friend is quite common for many cat owners. When the cat, for example, breaks something, scratches or bites, or jumps around the apartment while the human wants some peace, some cat owners react sensitively and vent their anger. It is understandable that you are not happy in such situations, but you must learn to control yourself. By scolding your cat, you hurt them because even if they don't understand the words, they sense that you're not saying anything good to them. However, they do not connect their actions with your scolding, so scolding cannot be effective as a disciplinary measure. Instead, your cat feels that you personally dislike them, leading to a decrease in their trust in you. Number 2. Yelling. Often, in the situations described, not only scolding occurs but the human also raises their voice. This is even worse than scolding itself because shouting at your cat scares them. It makes them feel threatened by you. Not only does it make them wary, but it can also make them fearful of you or even cause them to react aggressively by scratching or biting you or wreaking havoc in your home. This can quickly create a vicious circle where your cat exhibits unwanted behavior, you get angry, and your behavior reinforces that behavior. Number 3. Stress. We humans are used to being stressed and moving around hectically. It's a normal part of our daily lives. However, as a cat owner, you should try to avoid this as much as possible because it unsettles your furry companion. Restlessness gives them the feeling that some danger is present, even though they don't perceive any actual threat, and this uncertainty heightens their nervousness. They instinctively feel the need to be alert because there seems to be some unknown threat. The more often and more stress you spread, the more nervous your cat becomes. This can lead to behavioral disorders or even physical issues for them. Moreover, stress often means you don't have enough time for them, so, on top of the health burden, you also disappoint your cat. Number 4. Punishing. Another absolute no-go is punishment. Unfortunately, some cat owners use obscure training methods, such as not allowing the cat to play or withholding food. There are even people who physically harm their cats. It should be self-evident that such behavior is absolutely taboo, but it still needs to be said here. By punishing your cat, you hurt them and show them that you don't love them. Just like with scolding, they also don't understand that your unkind behavior is related to their undesirable action. If even a few seconds pass between their behavior and the punishment, they no longer recognize any connection. Punishments are not only hurtful but also pointless. Number 5. Noise. Cats are very sensitive to noise. They perceive sounds much louder than we humans do and can even hear frequencies that we don't notice. Loud noises put extreme stress on your furry friend's sensitive hearing, leading them to experience stress. Therefore, you should try to avoid loud noises as much as possible or protect your cat from them. For example, if you need to drill a hole in the wall or use a powerful blender, make sure your cat is not in the same room. And if you want to listen to loud music, don't suddenly turn the speakers to maximum volume but give your cat the opportunity to retreat. Number 6. Insufficient attention. An often unintentional mistake, especially for busy people, is not giving their cat enough attention. Although cats may demand attention on their own, for example by meowing, nudging, or rubbing against your legs, this is often a cry for help. Cats want their humans to notice them and interact with them. You should find enough time during the day for a loving glance, a kind word, or some cuddling. Of course, this doesn't apply to times when your feline friend is sleeping, grooming, or out on an adventure. At all other times, you should show your cat that you love them with glances and words. Also, respond to their approaches and play invitations, and take the initiative gently from time to time. Number 7. Long absences. Even worse than not getting enough attention when you're at home is being away for a long time for your cat. While cats do enjoy some alone time, they prefer to have their humans within reachable distance. 
When you're away for an extended period, your cat gets bored. This is especially true for indoor and single cats, but no cat appreciates when their human is away for a long time. They don't know what to do with themselves, which can lead to them either misbehaving or feeling melancholic. Moreover, long absences convey the feeling that they are not important to you and that you're not there for them, making it hard for them to trust you. Number 8. Incorrect Cuddling and Petting Cuddling and petting are very important for your cat's well-being. It gives them a sense of security and shows them that you love them. Also, it strengthens your bond. So, too little cuddling and petting are always bad. However, you should also be careful not to intrude on your cat. They don't always want to be petted, and sometimes they have simply had enough. You must respect that. Additionally, you should only pet your cat in places where they enjoy it. They will show you through their body language, sounds, and, if necessary, their claws and teeth, what they like and what they don't. Number 9. Insufficient Playtime As important as cuddling is, playing is equally important. It helps keep your furry friend physically and mentally stimulated. Moreover, playing together strengthens your positive bond. Ideally, you should spend at least half an hour each day playing with your cat. However, it shouldn't be too much, as it could cause them to become overexcited. Also, it's essential to choose games that are physically and mentally appropriate for your cat and are enjoyable for them. Number 10. Lack of Supervision Accidents can unfortunately happen quickly. For example, your cat might run onto the street, fall out of a window, burn themselves on the stove, or ingest something toxic. You can't prevent everything, but you can reduce the risk by being attentive to your cat within your influence and making sure there are no hazards in your home. As a loving cat owner, you should never recklessly put your cat in danger. Number 11. Incorrect feeding. Feeding your cat the wrong food can jeopardize their health. In particular, food with too few nutrients but containing sugar, grains, and a low percentage of meat is bad. Also, you must ensure that your cat maintains a healthy weight because few things have such a high potential for follow-up illnesses as obesity in cats. This can range from diabetes to painful joint diseases to heart and liver damage. All of this can likely be avoided with a healthy diet in the right quantity. Number 12. Ignoring signs of illness. Earlier, we talked about the importance of attention. This is not only emotionally important for your cat but also to maintain their health. By attentively observing your cat's body, behavior, and even their excretions, you can quickly notice signs of illness and promptly take them to the veterinarian instead of ignoring early warning signs of serious diseases. Number 13. Poor Hygiene Many cat owners also make mistakes when it comes to hygiene. They don't clean the litter box often enough or thoroughly wash the food and water bowls. Dirty bowls can lead to the growth of germs that your cat ingests while eating and drinking, which can make them sick. Poor litter box hygiene can also pose health risks and, in any case, makes your furry friend less inclined to use the litter box. Some cats may prefer to do their business outside the litter box, but even if your cat continues to use it as usual, they will feel extremely uncomfortable there. Would you like to know the 17 things you do too infrequently for your cat? Then click on the left image to find out in our video. Or are you interested in the 10 severe cat diseases you can prevent? Then click on the right image now.